Besides being the second richest man in the world, Jeff Bezos is a human being like any other who likes to enjoy his life. But have you ever stopped to wonder about how this billionaire lives in this video you will find out everything about Jeff Bezos, luxurious life born in 1964 in Albuquerque in the state of New Mexico. Jeffrey Preston Bezos, better known as Jeff Bezos, is the second richest man in the world coming from a somewhat broken home at just four years old, Jeff was adopted by stepfather, a Cuban immigrant called Miguel Mike Bezos in his youth. After getting his degrees in electrical engineering and computer science, he left a promising job at a major Wall Street management firm to go all in on the future of the internet. With only two years of existence, in 1997 Jeff Bezos' company opened its IPO showing its strength to the market. Initially, when Amazon was founded, it was just an online bookstore called Kadabra, and gradually it diversified the products. Advertised until it became a more complete enterprise on 5 July 2021 Jeff Bezos shocked the entire world when he formally resigned from Amazon. No longer CEO and armed with a net worth of $213 billion Bezos was retiring seven years younger and 172,000 times richer than the average retiree in America. Fast forward to today and I must admit that I am beyond curious. What has Bezos been spending his billions on in the past? Year and what crazy new things has he been up to since he hung up his Amazon gloves Amazon is a technology enterprise which operates in other sectors such as the movies and series platform, Amazon Prime and the cloud storage provider Amazon Web Services. And Bezos is also investing in other areas such as journalism and even aerospace exploration, founding Blue Origin, which promises to revolutionize the world. The $578 million real estate portfolio, the only thing that Bezos loves more than yachts, is land and properties most billionaires do. And when it comes to this niche, Bezos is a man of taste, unlike his counterpart Elon Musk, who doesn't mind sleeping in some $50,000 collapsible home, Bezos has been acquiring pricey properties since the late 90s back in 98 when Amazon was still a young company, Bezos paid $10 million for a 20,600 square foot, five-bedroom, four-bathroom house on a 5.3-acre property in Medina, Seattle. This property was in the same neighborhood with the world's richest man. At the time, Bill Gates, by 2005 Amazon's success was already touching the skies, so Bezos spent an additional $50 million on a neighboring 8,300-square-foot mansion with five bedrooms and four bathrooms. The properties combined had a staggering 310 feet of shoreline. Since then, Bezos has continued shelling tens of millions on properties and land all over America. At the height of the pandemic, he bought a $16 million three-bedroom condominium on the 20th floor of 212 Fifth Avenue, a locks Manhattan building. Prior to this purchase, he had already bought the 21st, 22nd, 23rd, and 24th floors of that same building for a sum total of $80 million in. The big boss from Amazon paid on this property $23 million plus $12 million with the renovations. However, in 2020 the tycoon acquired one of the most expensive properties in Beverly Hills, California. The property was built in 1937 by Jack L. Warner, co-founder of the film and entertainment. Production company Warner Brothers Pictures There are 350,000 square feet of total area and 13,000 square feet of built area, counting with a massive golf course, a swimming pool complex, tennis court, two guest houses, several gardens and open spaces. A few old illustrations of the interior of the property show classic Georgian architecture, which may have been modified or remodeled by Bezos. Being a globally known businessman, Jeff prefers to keep his life more private, not showing too much of his intimacy, and therefore there are not many details of his new mansion in the media. Jeff Bezos is now considered the second most powerful and richest man in the world and it is clear that he lives a rather luxurious life, far beyond what many could dream of living one day to take trips away from the spotlights. Resting with plenty of privacy on the high seas, Jeff Bezos acquired a luxury superyacht. Being over 410 feet long, the vessel is still under construction with an expected delivery date of 2022. That's because the ad is being custom made for one of the richest men in the world. And of course it has high demands, like a helipad being produced by Oshinko in the Netherlands. The expense to produce this luxurious little toy is estimated at half a billion dollars. Luxury Shopping Amazon founder Jeff Bezos is a man who is quite out of the curve, which is perhaps why he also has spending considered unusual for most people. One of his most expensive and quirky acquisitions is his robot dog, named Spot. The technological pack was designed for inspection and capturing data. 
Mountain clock, one of the most ridiculously expensive and yet ridiculously cheap luxury items you can ever find on the market, has to be wristwatches for a device that mostly functions to tell the time. Watches can be the most unusually expensive items on the market. Brands like Rolex or Patek Philippe can cost as much as millions of dollars, and they are often telltale signs of extreme wealth. Well, that's not really true, because Jeff Bezos and many other top billionaires, including Zuckerberg, Gates, and Elon Musk, either wear significantly cheaper watches or nothing at all. For example, after his retirement, Bezos has only been seen wearing a $12,000 Ulysses Narden dual-time Amazon headquarters. With such net worth and power, Jeff Bezos has plenty of money to leave his mark on the world. No wonder he does what he can to positively impact the lives of his employees and the environment. And that's why he built his company S headquarters based on sustainability, placing three sphere-shaped glass domes in the middle of Seattle. The house 40,000 plants of 400 different species brought in from more than 30 countries. The site provides employees of the largest online retailer with a work culture aimed at well-being and creativity, swapping conventional rooms and offices for nests in a relaxed environment with plenty of contact with nature. The entire headquarters occupies three blocks, while the spheres occupy 100,000 square feet, the equivalent of 24 basketball courts. Excursion into space. Jeff Bezos is crazy about technology and futuristic projects being one of his biggest ambitions nowadays, the further development of space missions. He is the founder of the Blue Origin Company, which aims to promote space tourist trips not only for astronauts but also for common citizens, besides taking the industrial processes that cause so much environmental impact on Earth out of our planet. Even in 2021 he made the first civilian pilotless flight into space in all of human history, alongside his brother or Bezos' 82-year-old aviator Wally Funk and 18-year-old Dutchman Oliver Damon, who paid to take part in the adventure. The entrepreneur has really been betting on this project, throwing a lot of money into it. To give you an idea, his rocket was launched straight from his property purchased in 2004 as well as supporting homeless families. In 2021 he also announced a $1 billion donation to environmental preservation, a project called the Bezos Earth Fund, not to mention his scholarship fund for undocumented immigrants. In the United States and so many other philanthropic projects in health, education and science, and it cannot be denied that the second richest man in the world is a great example to society having contributed a lot to the evolution of humanity. Thank you for watching. Please like share and subscribe our channel for more upcoming videos.